Hey, Steve Zook, welcome back to Pokes Your Channel. Hey, I'm playing this AH-20, and uh, actually, I was having a little trouble tuning the high string on the last video. I noticed that it actually, uh, part of the string was a little a little fragmented, so I actually took it off and put another one on, so it's, it's better now. But I want you to hear this guitar. This will be a short video. This is AH-20 with a solid cedar top, rosewood back and sides, really beautiful inlay, abalone on the fretboard and on the body and around the hole, but doesn't it have a nice sound? I can sell for 159. It just sounds beautiful. So I just wanted you guys to hear that. What a full sounding chord, huh? One note, you can hear that. That's like that's a lot of tone, folks. Especially for two fifty nine. You kidding? Wow. Every guitar is not this. If, if there's one point I need to drive home my YouTube videos, folks, because people always go, "What's better, this guitar or this guitar?" It depends on the individual guitar. Guitars vary greatly from guitar to guitar. This one really sings out. Guitars vary greatly from guitar to guitar, even the same make, same brand, same model. Even Chet Atkins said that. This one sounds excellent. Hear that? short ones you can hear it. This is a great jump.
I've been writing something recently like this. Sounds amazing, doesn't it? I like to do this guitar on a flamenco tuning too, where I'll make the low E a D and make the third string an F sharp, which is really cool too. But I just want to choke up a little bit here on the mic. I know recording engineers are going to send me an email saying, Why do you get so close to the mic? Like I said, I've played it a little bit, just like if you were to buy this in a store, you might see some of these little fine little marks here. You're going to do them anyway, but I just mentioned it. But yeah, this has really got a nice top on it, but it's got some really beautiful inlay on it. You can see the inlay around the sound hall, around the body, on both sides of the fretboard. This is really a nice guitar. I've owned, I've owned nylon strings worth thousands, and I like this guitar just as much. Take care, this is available. I can't put this down. see this a little bit if I move it. It's just this chord. Get you that kind of flamenco you sound. I'll do it for 259. No, it does not come with the case of 259. <laughs> Stop. 
stop playing this guitar. Listen to this A note. Folks, I'm using a $200 Zoom recorder. Listen to that. That sounds like a piano. That's a great sound. I really don't see how you can get much better than that. That's a beautiful tone. The thumb helps to get some weight in there. But anyway. Antonio Hermosa AH20, and this is the special one. Folks, I, this is what I specialize in. If I if I get a guitar in inventory and it's average, um, I usually don't sell it. I usually either send it back or donate it to charity or, you know, offer it. Uh, I, I just, you know, I'm really plugged in with the music link because I've helped them brand and promote it. It's not, you know, it's, it's something that I earned. I've earned my good hookup with the music link because I've helped them a lot. They've used my videos on their site. They've used the videos for the LH 350. The owner likes my playing. Brian Jones is a friend of mine. He's the national sales manager, so I really get good stuff from the music link. So whether you want a Lore Arch Top or Recording King or RD10, all solid wood for $399, whatever you need, I'm the guy to get it. And that's why people call me from all over the nation all the time to get them one of the best guitars from the music link.net. All right, folks, take care. All right, this is so hard to put down. <laughs>